Christian Atsu, Ghana funeral for footballer, died on Turkey earthquake. His funeral is being held outside state. He's even more than a football player, said Fedna Asar, a family friend. His name will forever be in our hearts because he has helped a lot of people. Atsu had been scheduled to fly out of southern Turkey hours before the quake, but the Ghanaian had opted to stay with the club after scoring the winning goal in a February 5 Super League match, house in Ghana's capital, Accra. In life I love you darling, in death I'll do the same, read the tearful tribute from the footballer's widow, Marie Claire Rupio. She was overcome with emotion and handed her speech to Atsu's sister to read. You did not go alone, for part of me went with you, it continued. Your smile, your love I see in our children's smiles, representatives of Ghana's national team and Atsu's Turkish club Hatayspor were also at the ceremony. Atsu's body was recovered a fortnight after the quake from the rubble of his apartment building. It was returned to Ghana almost a month ago. He will be buried later in his home village in southeastern Ghana. Atsu, 31, spent most of his career playing in the English Premier League for clubs including Chelsea, Newcastle, and Everton. He also made 65 appearances for Ghana and helped the national side reach the finals of the 2015 Africa Cup of Nations in Equatorial Guinea where he was awarded goal and player of the tournament. Many Ghanaians have told the BBC that Atsu will be remembered for his love for humanity and for supporting the underprivileged in the country. Hundreds of mourners and well-wishers filed past Atsu's body on Tuesday to say their farewells. Drumming and brass bands have been part of the colorful cultural display at an otherwise solemn event. Thanks watching my video hope you like it subscribe for more celebrity news.